What's up guys, I'm Josh and welcome back to another JBG fishing video. Today I have hand selected I think five or so baits from my arsenal to test out on the water today see if we can get some big old bass off the bank. So it should be fun and I'll show you the lures then we're gonna get to the lake. All right guys, so first things first, we got a Z-Man chatterbait here with a Kai Tech on the back. And we also got a little finesse worm. I think I got this at a fishing show for like a buck a pack. Next, we got a Strike King Rage Tail in green pumpkin with black flakes. We're gonna Texas rig this, I think. All right, next we got this mini crankbait. I don't know how well this is gonna do. Next, we got a Sakoshi bug that we're gonna Ned rig with this hard hat jig. Should work some magic out on the lake. There you have it guys, five baits. I'm gonna challenge myself to catch one fish on each one. So let's head on out to the lake. All right guys, I am on the way to the lake. I have about four hours to fish before I have to be home. Um, so hopefully we can get this little slam challenge done and have some fun while we're at it. We are at the lake. So we're gonna grab this rod and this rod. Traveling a little light today. We also can't forget our little bag of goodies that has all the slam baits in it. So yeah, let's get on. There's a guy looking at me. So wish me luck and let's get on the water. All right, so we are at the first spot. There's the road and there's the pond. Literally 20 feet away. Just a perfect roadside pond. It looks kind of mucky out. Hopefully I can try my best to make the baits weedless. I think I'm gonna do the Texas rigged craw first because that's the one I have the most confidence in. But let's get to it. First cast of the slam. Let's go! Just a little one, but I got him on the second cast of the day. He ate the craw, so first bait, down. All right, so now that the craw's done, I'm gonna tie this finesse worm on and it's gonna go on a shaky head. I switched it to my spinning rod because it's a pretty light bait. Yes! I wasn't even expecting it either. Hey, on the finesse shaky head. There you go, guys. Just a little quick look. So I was casting it and popping it off the bottom and nothing was biting and I was just reeling in to take another cast and this guy came up and straight pummeled it. There we go. We're moving. New spot check. I can also uh, officially confirm that the mosquitoes and bugs are out in full force now. That is the new shoreline spot I'm gonna be fishing. And hopefully this one is a little more productive and uh, produces more sizable fish than the last one. Stay tuned. All right, next up, we got the Sakoshi bug on a Ned rig. All right, let's see if it works. Yes! Yes! No way, I saw him swimming toward it. I go boom, boom, and he bit. Okay, I know this is a little bit of a downsize, but uh, at least we got another bait knocked out. Let's get him back. All right, 
chatterbait time. Yeah, this bait's over. All this cotton in the water is getting like stacked up on my line to the point where I can't even cast and it's, the chatterbait isn't helping because it's not weedless either. This is probably the worst bird nest I've ever had. So I think I'm just gonna go back to the other spot and cast with that crankbait and see if anything can bite. Uh, maybe th throw the chatterbait a little later once I get this all sorted. Guys, right, so we're at the old spot and I got this mini crankbait. Hopefully I can either catch a bass on it or a panfish. Just kind of complete this last lure. I failed miserably on the chatterbait, so let's get it. So I just caught a bass on the crankbait, um, but I didn't record it because I thought it was recording. I go back and it says it's on picture mode, so that's great. Anyways, I just caught like the dinkiest bass of my life on that crankbait, but at least we got it knocked out You guys are just gonna have to take my words for it um, But yeah Hopefully I can get the chatterbait to work. Um, we're gonna give it a last good try um, If not, I will see you at the car But let's hope we get a fish Well, no luck on the chatterbait, so that's all she wrote for today um all in all, I think it was a good day. I mean, I caught four all under a pound. I had like a one pound bag kind of day. Although I knocked out four out of the five baits, um, it was just not how it was planned, but you know, nothing ever really is. So yeah, it was definitely a struggle. I got lit up and eaten alive by mosquitoes out there. Um, I didn't realize they were gonna be that bad. If, if I had, I would have brought bug spray. But all excuses aside, um, it was a fun idea, I just didn't execute it how I wanted. So if you guys are burnt out of fishing at all, or if you're just trying to kind of have a change of scenery for what you use or what you catch fish on, um, I feel like this is kind of a good challenge. Pick like four or five or however many you want um, baits out of your tackle arsenal and then just use them and see if you can catch fish in all of them. Maybe I'll do it like a random challenge next time. I just thought what baits might be like a little bit hard to catch fish on and I used them. So anyways guys, thank you for watching this video. Um, and I promise in my other videos I catch bigger fish. And if you liked it or any of my other videos, um, don't forget to subscribe if you want. And then like the video if you liked it and uh, give me some feedbacks in the comments on some other video ideas. I have like a whole list in the notes of my phone um, on video ideas and I just wanna make that list bigger. So with that being said, this has been another JBG Fishing video. Hope you guys have a good day. Peace out.